Hey guys, it's me, Meteor, and welcome back to Kirby Planet Robot. Here we're going to be going in Area 6, the Access Arc. All kinds of fun is to be had here. Either way, if you notice, you'll actually go back there to Area 1, so it makes full circle there. So that's nice. Either way, let's begin. Ooh. That looks intimidating. It's way off there in the distance. Lots of machinery. Where's this going to take us? Well, inside, but what awaits us? Guess we'll have to find out. Here we are in his hallway here, near the entrance of his house, or ship, whatever. Love the music here, that was like the boss team, except more upbeat. There's little minions there, have little spark guns. Thankfully, they don't really affect us all too much. Hmm. Don't, eh, I've turned off of PSI, or ESP. That's close enough. When I first saw these, I thought they were pointing like some kind of secret room there, but they're not. They caught me off guard, so they're pointing to something. Ow. I should have actually had my little spark ready beforehand. Let's keep running. Run! I have no time for your games. I'm in a rush, I'm in a hurry. Run! Ooh, we have a mini boss coming up. This is actually a new one. Here we have Security Force, or Metal General, really. I mean, uh, I I'm going to assume that Haltman owns, uh, might have taken over Egg Engines because Metal General's just, uh, essentially a more advanced version of this, and that place already looks mechanized beyond all repair, so I'm pretty sure Haltman took over that one. But, uh, that has yet to be confirmed. But, uh, it seems logical. Ow. Wow. I am... Why am I doing so badly against you? You're like one of the easiest mini-bosses. Either way, you can't actually inhale him. He actually sets himself on fire and expl and kills himself. That's a little residue there of explosion as well. Hmm. Interesting. Food! Yay! Give me my spark back. Well, that was fun. Hooray, our first code cube. Very easy to grab. Very there in the middle of nowhere. Kind of hard to miss, honestly. But there you go. Die. What? What the? I, I, I had my spark shield on. How come I got hit? Whatever. I guess it's not flawless. Maybe next time. What's in this? We have an invincibility level pop, so run! Run! We. And if you're super quick, you just wait here, kill him. You even kill him before he can even set himself on explode. Interesting. Either way, finally we reach the end of this. And you'll see three switches. Of course, pretty obvious which one to use. Just look at the foreground there. And you'll see this middle in the middle is actually the chest. Yay! You know, why does Hellman put those up there? I mean, they seem like they're probably like suffocate or something. I don't know. Maybe they have like lunch break or something. They work actually get out of their trap. I don't know. If you go up here though, you'll see a secret crevice. Woo. You get a nice little one up from that. But that's not all, you'll also see a little crack in the painting. If you go in here... Oh, the guys are just like chatting there, just chilling, just enjoying life. Whatever, why not? 
And you'll see a giant Howl room there. Oh, Broom Hatter's not there on the Howl this time. Hmm. Looks like there's an intruder here. Can't have that. Die. Yay! You also get the Smash ability. First, I'm gonna break all these first. We. He's back. Not for long, though. Gotta get all of the. Wow, it didn't actually break the last one. That's surprising. Yeah, there's a lot to be had there. Max and Tomatoes, stars, up to Wazoo. Die. And it will grab. Well, I didn't need to. I didn't really need to exhale my power, but now I have the Smash Brothers ability. Ooh, hold on. Gotta show off a new attack. Airdrop. Always a cool little ability. You have to hold B right next to you get to the opponent. Kind of like you would grab normally with opponents. You don't see grabbing used all too much. I mean, almost every ability has a grabbing attack. Ow. I just didn't really use it. Either way, we have a rare sticker and two, two, that. two code cubes. Or wait, hold on. No, we, ha we don't have a rare sticker yet. You will get it, though. And notice these pipes. You want to get to the one that isn't going to take you over to the other side, but take you in the midway point. Like, uh, this one right here. Now, see three. Want to go in the middle one, obviously, because that one's there. Ta-da! And then, finally, you'll see a bomb, and you'll see if I could open up there. However, if you actually want to go down here, because you'll notice... Actually, first, let's break that. We Look at that. We I can just go all the way down like that. And there's our rare sticker. Yeah, all you need now is one last code cube, which is super easy to find. But hey, it's there. We We Fine, gonna do it that way? Ah. Ha ha, you can't use your little buddies. I'm terrible with the Smash ability, because I'm terrible at Smash Brothers in general, so there's that. I'm probably gonna end up dying. There we are. Perfect. I just think it looks cool. I think the actual power of each item is actually reduced significantly. Like the hammer doesn't do as much as normal hammer would and so on and so forth. But alas, by the way, this little switch down here that's ever so slightly hidden. And we'll get our last code cube there. Hooray! And also let's get our little piece there. You know what? Now I'm back at full health again. Yay! I actually should have waited because the gold game would have actually given me food. But hey, whatever. Goal game! That's gonna be a two. I got too careful. Oh well, it happens. Yay! Yeah, see, I would have healed if I would have just waited. And I still had something in resource. We have a balloon. We have a Waddle Doo Doodle. Waddle Doodle. <laughs> uh, ooh, 100 unique stickers. Yay, only 100 more to go. Our rare sticker here is the Haltman Works Company logo. Woo. Either way, we're actually going up. We're not going side to side. We are going up this building, this ship. We are getting to the bottom, or rather the top of this. And here we have some kicking music again, baby. Ah, yes. Laser beams everywhere. And you can see the little gear thing moving back and forth. Oh, man, I love this music so much. Poison. Oh, whoops. I I still had, uh, smash. Okay, well, fair enough. Smashing. That's cool. We have little uh, ability things there. You see him uses hazards here, which you haven't really seen since, I don't know, Superstar I haven't released. Well, actually, no, there was some time in Return to Dreamland in Egg Engines where, uh, hey, speaking of Egg Engines, where you actually, uh, those little sleep things were actually put out in 
you know, forget it, whatever. I, I messed up in the depth perception there. Where they actually laid him off his hazards. If you grab one, you actually fall asleep and you actually get by lasers or something. But, uh, I believe the one in Egg Engines made you fall off the edge because you're going at high speeds or something like that. I don't know. I could very well be wrong. Either way, just tilt it. Yay! Tilting mechanics you haven't seen for a while. Since, like, Jibble Deluxe, which they've kind of, like, minimized here significantly. But they still exist. Don't get too crazy. Never mind. You know what? It's fine. I didn't need the beam anyway. It'd be nice if I could, like, charge while I'm actually inside one of these little ship things. Ow. You know what? Fine. I'm never good at actually dodging these. Like, at all. Wee. Oh, oh, before you go any further, I gotta go up here. Our rare sticker is right there. What? Oh, I could actually, like, kind of land on those, and it made, like, little dink sound like you couldn't actually hurt them. Huh. Okay. Fair enough. We have a little robot mechanoid thing here again. Wait for it. Yes. This is one of my favorite parts of the little robot guy, for one particular reason in general, which I thought was pretty pretty hilarious the first time I saw it, but anyway. Kick. Haha. Uh -huh. Knock down that little shot, so. And be on our merry way again. Alright, so I'm gonna wait for you. You're gonna wait for me. You could all be a happy family. Just once again. Ah, oh, nope. I don't need a jump for that one. Whoops. Yeah, I was gonna go back to try and walk it towards the. Uh... All right, so now I'm back to even again. And now we see these powers here. Don't need them. Don't need them at all. Just walk towards and dead. <laughs> oh, I loved that. But that switch also actually broke some blocks over there to the left. So let's go in there. Break this. And there's a secret door here. Woo. Let me grab poison here real quick. Yay. Hooray. And then finally, hit this switch. And then it'll fall down ever slowly. And voila! Our first code key right there. Hooray for poison! Yay! Killing stuff and things. Die. Wow, you survived. Good job. You have, like, durability of Wazoo. Very nice. Hallman pays a lot for you, I'm sure. I wonder what does Hallman pay, pay his people? What do he pays and empl employs? Must be like uh, six figures, I'm going to assume. Maybe even like seven, perhaps. I don't, I don't know, it looks like he has a lot of money to me. But uh, I guess we'll see. This battery is important because they get a little one up from it. That's not very important there. However, this is gonna be an ongoing trend. Spoiler. Naughty, hey, what's up, whoops. Oh well, honestly, we're sleeping anyway. It's not gonna be much different, so there's that. All right. We and now we have a pep brew. Oh, that's nice. Very useful. We actually needed that. And then finally, run. Yep. This is the longest one here. Now you'll see this. Uh, those actual panels glowing if it's actually the dead time. So at that point, if it glows. That's when you want to jump over here. Quickly! Yay! And now we have our second code cube. Very nice. Ah, uh, you're out of my reach. Fine, I'll just have to do you the old fashioned way. Ooh. Haha. -ha. Why, you literally just ran into the poison. Eh, poison's there. I'm just gonna run right directly into it. Now these switches are permanent. You don't have to worry about pressing them again. If you notice they disappear once you actually touch them. Make sure you hit pretty much every switch that you see. You need to do this to get that code cube at the very end. It is very important. 
Whoops. Whoa. I also was afraid I didn't have an attack that I actually, actually hit underground there for a second. But thankfully I did. We. There's no way to get. There's no way to actually head down here if you didn't actually knock all the switches. So you have to actually get every single switch to actually get to the very end of this. There's no cheesing it. By the way, our last code cube is right there for us. How nice. How thoughtful of them. That's death. Don't want to fall to death. Death is a bad thing usually in most circumstances. Hooray, food. And we are done. Now we have the goal game. Sweet, full power. Yay! All right, so let's see our sticker here. You have the Kirby sticker. We have Z oh wait what? Nightmare was oh we now I'm thinking of uh, something else that's coming up. We have Nightmare Wizard here. We have the Dream Kanji, and you have Mr. Shine. By the way, we unlock area st or stage three. Woo. By the way, I think we are done here. We are actually done with the access. Or not the access. Yeah, we're done with stage with stages one and two. So next time we create Planet Robot, we'll be going to stage three and possibly four, maybe five. Who knows? By the way, I will see you guys next time.